Hi, my name is Stella Luna, and what is yours? My name is Jeff Wright. Um, I work for the Minecraft Tribune. The Minecraft Tribune? Yes. Okay. And I would like to ask you just a few questions. Okay. Um, so, when you... What made you think... What is your relationship to this place? What is your relationship to this place? My relationship to this place? I am... Uh, my dad built this place. And, and with my dad, we decided that we would convert some of the storage places that we have here into artist studios for people to work in. Because this, this is a storage, it used to be a storage place. It's still a storage place. Has that been worked out well for you? You know, it has worked out far beyond anything I could have imagined it to be. It, has, it is probably one of the most gratifying things that I've done in my life. It's been super, super cool because all these artists have shown up and they work together and they are collaborating with each other and there's a community here and there's creativity that's going on and it's alive. It's alive in a, in a way that it never was. What are your plans for the future? Well, our plans for the future are to continue to say yes when people have ideas. So we have, we've got a lot of space here and, uh, and people come to us with different ideas for things that they want to do or try and mostly we try to, try to figure out a way to make space for people to do it, to do what they want. Um, what, are you an artist? I'm not an artist, but I was just talking with, with, with uh, another artist here, John Morris today, who actually told me that he had a little experience doing drawing when he was a kid and then he went to high school and became an engineer and, and, and had a family and raised kids and, and he didn't have time to become an artist but then he decided to go back to art school and he started with learning, taking a drawing class at a community college and then just advancing from there and he does, he does really nice work and so I'm thinking maybe I should maybe take a drawing class and see what happens. Okay, um, have you ever thought about doing art maybe? Uh, well, most of my most of most of the artistic things that I've done in my life have been really probably more around music, um, and I'm so I'm a terrible guitar player. Uh, but you know, part of part of what's interesting for me is that having so many artists come here, it almost sometimes it almost feels like this space itself is my palette, and I get people to help me make it beautiful. Okay, and what are you going to do with the tower? What am I going to do with the tower? <laughs> Such a good question. I'm going to break some more rules. <laughs> I'm going to light that tower up like in a way that it's never been lit up before. We're going to we're going to uh, to remove the time and temperature. Actually, we're going to replace the time and temperature sign uh, with it's it's going to be time and temperature. You might call it time temp 2.0. That alliterates T T T. Time temp 2.0. And we're going to put a we're going to do a LED light sculpture up there. It'll still tell time and temperature, but it's going to have some other things that it says too. What's the timeline on that? The timeline on the time temp tower? Yeah. Oh, a while. A while. Three four months probably. I'm going to. So my intention is to build to is to start to, to build one three by three foot panel that we're going to hang up there within the next month. Excellent. Yeah. Oh, it's coming together. Um, is there anything else you want to say? Thank you for doing this work. Where are you going to put it? Where is it going to go? It's going to go to all the other artists in here. It's and going to take a week at least to yeah. edit We're going to edit it. Yeah. Yeah. Well, that's great. Go put it up on the website. Yeah, put it up on the website. Julia can, uh, yeah, we'll do can post it. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, that's well, great. Thank you and have a good thank day. Thank you, Stella. <laughs> Not that we